Hey, what's up, guys? Um, just wanted to show you how I uh, I have figured out how to balance these little little five-inch props. There's no real good tutorial on on how to balance them, so uh, I just wanted to go over my method. And uh, this one's already done. I had a camera fail earlier, so we'll do this again. All right. So I've got the Dubro True Spin here. And the stock mandrel, for whatever reason, with the little 5-inch props, was not sensitive enough. So what I came up with is I bought a 5mm aluminum tube. And it came from KS Engineering. They have little metal setups at uh, a lot of the hobby shops, and you can buy them on eBay. And it's just a 5 millimeter aluminum tube. Now mine was a little bent when I got it. They come in a pack of three for like 10 bucks. And I actually rolled it on my table with a piece of steel. And got, it, got it to go, go straight again. And um, I also cut myself a nice little edge here. So it's not just a blunt end. This is easier to get on the props. And so right here, got a brand new Gemfan 5.4. Guaranteed to be off. Stick it on there. There's there's our heavy side. Little piece of tape. This one's not bad. No, oh, so I stand corrected. Yeah, I found tons of videos for balancing regular size props, which I already knew about, and uh, none for these little guys. So we're all using them. If you get them balanced laterally. It's good enough for the flight controller to be happy and not to get any jello with my Xiaomi Yi. And uh, yeah, this, this system right here works really well. Uh, I've been very happy with the performance after I've been balancing props. I'll do another one real quick. Brand new bag. Take the prop. Stick it on. It's already showing me which side's the heavy side. Usually just takes a couple, two or three little little pieces of tape. Now this does not seem to be good enough to do the um, hub balancing, but at this size, I don't really think it matters. As long as you get it balanced fairly well with the laterally, it works really well. And I, I would be happy with that. That would give me very good performance. So I hope this helps you guys. If not, you know, whatever. I'm sure you got a better method maybe with a magnetic balancer, which I also have right here, a little top flight piece of crap. Never had good luck with that. The the mandrel seems to walk on the, on the magnets a little bit. So um, I've always liked this balancer better. A little more money, but with this nice 5mm piece of tube, it does a great job. So... Um, thanks for watching. Hope it helps. Talk to you later.